Okay guys, here is the last of the heroes from the Back O'Hare toy line. And that is but last but not least Captain Bucky O'Hare himself. He is a green hair. Must I say he's actually quite cool. I do like him. I know a lot of the time he won't be missing his gum. Or his cape at the back would have frayed it's only a bit of cheap rubber. And it'll eventually disappear. But Bucky O'Hare himself is pretty cool. He actually does look like his cartoon character, so they did that pretty well. His articulation is pretty poor. His arms will bend that way, that far back. That's it. His wrists do rotate, which is quite cool. His head would do, but I'm worried about it fraying for his cape. His ears rotate, which is pretty cool actually. I do like that. His legs go forward and backwards so much during that stupid pose. You can get some cool like jumping poses. Blank special. Now Bucky was the captain of the kind of rebels against the toads. And he's pretty cool. I do actually do like him. He was my favourite character. A lot of people didn't like him but I enjoyed him. He's a fun, fun around good character. He also had his lucky team of Dead Eye Duck, Bruce, Barbarian, his humanoid friend Willie, and his chief engineer Blinky. Now, all together, they are cool. These are the main crew of the Righteous Indignation, and all together look really cool. I'm really pl pl glad to have these. And all the accessories except for Willie's glasses, but oh well. Together they all look absolutely amazing. And a great toy line. It's a shame they only got a, a series one wave. It would have been cool to have more characters, but these are the main core characters and do look really good together. And I'm very glad actually I actually got all these. I only had I think Bucky and Willie as a kid. Had Toad Borg and a Toad. I didn't have many but as I got older, I was able to buy all these in my collection. I bought most of them in one big job lot for 20 quid. They're not expensive to pick up. Are they worth it? In my opinion, if, I, if you watch the show, yes they are. They're not as expensive and they're just fun little things to have. But that is my complete Buck Your Hair Good Guys collection. At some point I will move on to the villains, but thank you for watching and bye for now.